Hey everybody, guess what? We got seat backs. We were able to do these in a way that we can still get to the uh, emergency handles. I think that will be more than enough adequate room for the bus inspectors to do everything. So right there you can tell we've got a little bit of an arc at the top of each one. I, I did run them all the way back to the wall even though that one right there in the back, I don't know what I'm doing back there yet so that may not stay there but for the most part though we've got the seat backs in. And the uh, We got the seat backs in, put a two by four up under here, and behind this, I just took a, uh, a small piece of half inch, cut it, you know, at the same width all the way across. That way, when I go to put those on there, that gives me that little bit of a angle. Because, you know, I don't like these, these things to sit flat. I like to kick them out a little bit. So we've got that taken care of. The back plates are all in. Of course, those will have to come out to uh, cover everything and also spray the back side of them because, because they come up on the windows a little bit right there. Let's walk out here a second. On the outside of the window, you can actually see the, uh, the wood. So we will get all that blacked out and everything before it all goes into final assembly. So I think that's everything that I got done today. It was all about the seat backs. I think that's looking pretty good. So that is my update for today. Hope everybody has a happy day. We will catch you on the flip side. Digger is out. Hey everybody, another little thing I thought I'd just let you guys know about. If you notice in the background here, something is missing. Uh, last Sunday, I sold the 1963 Ford Falcon that I had custom painted all purple with the spiderweb lace all over it. Who knows? Might get another one. I'm done with Falcons. I've had I've had four Falcon wagons now in the last six or seven years, so I'm a little burnt out on the Falcon thing. Even though I think I still say that they're fantastic cars, I love them. I always will. But uh, I think my days of owning a Ford Falcon have passed so who knows i've been looking at a at a 65 ford van uh kind of looking around at maybe some dune buggies because i've never had a fiberglass body Volkswagen. sounds like that could be kind of fun for right now though i'm putting all my concentration into bus builds so just thought i'd let everybody know because i know a couple people have commented that they always see that falcon in the background but Unfortunately, it's not there now. It was definitely a little bit of a tearjerker seeing it leave. A uh, guy put it on a trailer and took it to Northern Ohio. It's time for somebody else to have some fun with it. There's the catch up for the week. Thought I'd let you guys know. We will catch you on the flip side. Digger is out. Pew. And hey, YouTubers, don't forget to hit that little subscribe button and maybe even that little ding ding bell thing that way. You get updated and you know what's going on right after I do it. So uh, tune in. There's more to come. The party starts here.